Hey man, kids, it's Rob Boyd again. This is for everybody because I am uh, skiing on the PCT right now because my skis are not motorized. And I came across this uh, little funky tree. You can see that it's been cut off over on this side. Um, but I always call this the elephant tree. It looks like a sort of a small headed elephant, no bit, no ears, but a uh, big, long, groovy trunk. So maybe if you come over here, you can look for the elephant tree. It's between Buck Summit and Big Creek Road. Or you might find uh, something super cool on your section, Pacific Crest Trail. So anyway, I just wanted to show you that. Look for the, uh, the elephant tree or some other cool tree or feature. And then I'm just gonna ski up here, a little bit up the trail, just to show you the placard, which is the little logo of the Pacific Crest Trail. Um, I'm sure some of you have seen this before. They even put it on shirts and hats. And funny enough, the guy who's in charge of the whole Pacific Crest Trail, Justin Coyman, he lives in Plumas County. Imagine that. Here, I'm gonna see if I can zoom in. And there we go. So Justin Coyman, who has two kids in the Portola schools. I will not out them. I'm going to embarrass them, but uh, they're in junior high and high school right now, and Justin Coyman is in charge of the whole PCT from Canada to Mexico. He used to just be over the section between um, South of Tahoe all the way through here and all, um, a little bit further north towards Bernie, but he was doing such a good job they promoted him, and he's the big boss now. So another reason to go out as a Plumas County mountain kid and celebrate the Pacific Crest Trail and look for the secret sign. All right, take care, bye.